Okay, guys, and we look at the last topic. This is training to improve teamwork. Okay, please look at this ball. Okay, guys, for this box form, Bruce Tuckman model of team state. Brooks Tuckman has studied group dynamic and he tried to summarize the development of team into the state of group development model. So there are four steps or four elements of teamwork. Uh, for this one, for the first one, forming is first state is described by approach avoidance issues as well as internal conflicts about being independent versus wanting to be a part of the team. Team members usually tend to pay itself and minimize their risk taking in case something goes wrong. Teamwork in this state is at its lowest level and the next level this means storming the second state is characterized by a competition for power and authority, which is the start of most of the conflicts and doubts about the success of the team. If teamwork is low in this state, it is very unlikely that the team will get past their conflicts. If there is a high degree of teamwork and willingness to collaborate, then the team might have a brighter future. And the third one does mean norming. The third state is characterized by increasing levels of solidarity interdependence and cohesiveness while simultaneously making an effort to adjust to the team environment. Okay, next. This test shows much higher levels of a teamwork that make it easier for the above characteristic to occur. And the last one, performing. This final state of team development includes a comfortable environment to which team members are effectively completing tasks in an interdependent and cohesive manner. This state is characterized by the highest levels of comfort, success, interdependence, and maturity, and therefore includes the highest levels of teamwork. Okay, next, what are teamwork skills? Teamwork skills are essential to your success at work no matter your industry or your job working well with clients colleagues managers or other people in your workplace can help you complete start effectively while creating an enjoyable environment both for yourself and others okay what are soft skills important? Soft skills play an important role in resume writing, interviewing, job performance, and finding success in communicating with people at work and in other areas of your life. Okay, for this one, we talk about the basic of the resume about about soft skills important so i hope you just know about this okay 15 example of soft skill to include on the resume communication customer service problem solving skill organizational skills resilience public speaking teamwork, all collaboration skills, interpersonal skills, critical thinking, leadership or management skills, persistence, persuasion, networking, negotiation, proactive. And seven important teamwork skills you need to in school and your career. First, communication skill. Next, time management skill. You can manage your time. Next, problem solving. 
listening critical thinking collaborating leadership okay guys thank you for your attention and try to understand the slide and after this ajan jup will assign your group work and please look at our open chat and then ajan jup will explain in that channel okay so we finished for lecture bye bye and see you next week